Oh, holy days! Do I ever have a lot of hen hens? How do I always forget how many hen hens I have on my plant? And then I pop back in and it's just, they're overflowing with hen hens and look at them all jump around. Oh my gosh. Well, that is wonderful. And hello everyone and welcome back to Slime Rancher. And there have been a couple more updates that I have missed. So let me go ahead and we are going to pop into the house and we are going to curl up with our adorable little slime plushie and sleep until morning. And let's pop out to the ranch. Dun dun dun! Look at my beautiful trees! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited that I have these moss trees and I forgot I had so many hen hens. How do I forget this? They're everywhere and they're so cute! Oh, and it looks like Honey Mint needs a, a new mint tree. So let's go ahead and plant a new mint tree really quickly. No rooster root! No rooster root, I said! Out you go! Go play with the other hen hens and things like that. Alright, and I'm gonna gather up these mints. Good morning, Honey Mint! Do I ever have something super special I need to work on for you, my friend? There are so many new slime decorations! The little clip-on accessories that you can put on your slimes. And I really have been wanting to get just the right one to be able to put on Honey Mint for quite a while. But if I recall correctly, I'm pretty much broke. I know we have about, like, we're two coins shy, or whatever you're going to call our intergalactic space units, shy of having a ton of uh, money by about 9,000, uh, I guess, space coins? I'm just going to call them 9,000 coins. But it costs a lot of money to get those really adorable clip-on accessories to be able to decorate all of our adorable little Largos and all of our adorable slimes. And apparently you can even put the clip-on accessories on the Gordos. Isn't that so cute? Okay, I'm going to leave some of the honey mints on the ground. So honey mint will have something to play with. And let me go ahead. I keep calling them honey mint. I mean mint mangoes, but you guys know what I mean. Honey mint is... Oh, there you are, Honey Mint. Don't surprise me like that. I'm always worried about you. All right, so yeah, we have a lot to do. We have things to collect. We have different resources to gather. And we've got money to make. So let's go ahead and check on the research area. And I want to see... I think there's, like, new portals you can get. There's, like, more of these portals, so you can have multiple types. There's a whole bunch of new treasure pods all over the place. Ooh, all right. Need to do a little more gardening. Uh, oh, it's already growing these, so that's fantastic. Wonderful. I can feed some of my little ones. And then I need to start doing some strategic money making, too, because that's one of the things that was really holding us up last time, is I am a little bit low on funds when it comes to buying all of the fancy clip-on accessories and all of the other things that I really want to be able to give to our slimes. Oh, look at that! I think that's new! Now when you have the cuberry tree, it has that really pretty little moss effect on it. Oh, I love how they're always constantly trying to improve the really cool things that can happen with the trees and the way that everything looks. It's just so nice. All right, so you guys love the Q-berries, if I remember correctly. Yep, they've got their little happy hearts popping up. So that means we're going to toss the Q-berries into this feeder. And from what I was reading, they've also fixed it so the Q-berries will no longer have that one odd Q-berry that just pops on top of the bush. This is so cute. And for some reason, I'm just in a weird mood right now. So I'm staring at this Q-berry bush and all I can think about is Garnet from Steven Universe. I wonder why. That's pretty hilarious. All right, now we've got some carrots for these guys. Oh, look at them. My little glowy butt slimes. They're so happy. You guys remind me so much of glow butt bugs. Also known to those of you who are not familiar with the phrase glow butt bugs as lightning bugs. All right, so here we are. Let's see if we have any more. I can get the googly eye fashion pod. Ugh, I need to do treasure hunting. And then I think I have the clip-on fashion pod, but I have to build it. Yeah, I've got the clip-on fashion pod. Uh, and then I wonder if I have to buy the googly eye fashion pod to start unlocking some of the other ones. So I'll go ahead and buy the googly eyes, even though I don't really want the googly eyes. And the clip-on, I don't really want that one either. There's like little crowns and mustaches and monocles and so many other things. And I need to find more of the treasure pod. So I really need to spend some time treasure hunting too. But what was it that I was trying to find? Uh, the clip on fashion pod royal jelly. Okay, so I think we're gonna go sell some stuff so that I can buy the googly eyes just in case that unlocks it and um, Let's see. What do I have a lot of that? I can sell a whole bunch of let's see. Hi guys Oh, do you guys want some mint mangoes? Maybe do you they eat veggies? That's just I gave them some mint mangoes as a, a snack I guess or like as a toy. All right, let's come this way. Hmm. I'll gather up these rods. I probably have plenty of rods for crafting into new materials. 
Let's gather that up. Nope, 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 nope. Don't want to. I really don't think it's safe to just leave radioactive material uh, kind of scattered all over the place. Let's gather up these boom ports. There we go. And maybe I can just really quickly. Okay, hi, everybody. Oh, that's right. You're radioactive. Oh, you're loose. Oh, my. Okay. Um. Okay. Can I knock you? There we go. There you go, my little one. I totally forgot that I could knock you guys with water to disperse your radioactivity really quickly. All right, everybody back. All right, I think I got everything I could get. All right, wonderful. Totally forgot about that. Here, have a carrot. All right, good. So that should take care of them. What else can I sell extras of? I always need more of the luminous. Uh, let's run inside the cave system and I'll see if I can fill up on some more slimes or some more plorts really quickly. And then I really need to do some treasure hunting. I've actually even tried looking up guides to treasure hunting. Oh, yay! My puddles have gone and like laid me some more puddle slimes. Well, I need stuff I can sell right now. Crystal slimes, I think, sell for okay. All right, they're mostly veggie diet, these guys. So I need to get them some veggies. Oh, I love those crystal decorations. Man, in Slime Rancher, every time I jump back in, I'm like, oh, everything's so beautiful. And I just get so distracted. Um, let's grab some of these crystal slimes and try sell, or crystal plorts, excuse me, and try selling them. You guys like meat and veggies. I have a bunch of mint mangoes. So I'll have to go back to my little, my little apiary and give the mint mangoes to some of my other slimes. All right, a lot of mint mangoes and nowhere to put them. All right, so let's see. Ooh, those hunter sli or those hunter plorts are selling for quite a bit right now. Oh, and honey plorts. Ooh, look at that on the rad. All right, that was a smart choice on my end, bringing in some rad and some booms. Those are gonna fill things up. Look at that, beautiful, beautiful. And then I guess I might as well save the crystal plorts because they're not really worth a lot right now. Uh, so let's go back to the apiary. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, look at those beautiful flowers. There's a hen hen butt in my mushrooms. Oh, and I just I just was like held up by a hen hen. I don't know, you guys. You don't want to come this way. I'm trying to tell you this is going to end up in death. All right, so everybody, oh, look at them all play. I love watching them play over here. Everybody is just so happy. Oh, the hunters, that's right. The hunters uh, end up having lots of, oh, look at everybody. Gosh, they're so cute. And look at all those beautiful, beautiful plorts. Just so many plorts for the picking. All right, come here, plorts. I wish I could have a little plort Roomba. That would be the best. I want to see that as a future slime. I know I've talked about it before, but I mean it. I really want to see that as like a future slime science thing that we could have. Plort Roombas. You can just like leave them. Maybe they have like a radius that they wander around. And you can just come back and there we go. Get the old mint mangoes out of the way. All right. Hi, everybody. Am I about to be here? Mint mangoes. Mint mangoes for everyone. I feel like my population of Largos back here has really gone down significantly. So I may have to come in and I may have to check on that. All right. Let's see. I guess everybody, as long as the honey mint plants, or excuse me, the mint mango plants... Honeyman is my little farming, uh, my little farming Largo that I have. But as long as they continue to drop the fruit, I don't really have to bring food back here. I just need to make sure that these guys get plenty of food. All right, so let's see. Maybe I'll grab some of them. Hi, hey everybody. I'm trying to collect up some of these. Don't mind me. But yeah, I want a port Roomba. That would be really fun. Maybe it could even malfunction and just like start spraying plorts everywhere on occasion. That'd be kind of hilarious. All right, so let me toss in these mint mangoes. And do I have any apiaries in here? I don't think I do. Oh, I do! It's not done though. Gosh darn, it's almost done. Well, that would have been really cool, but oh well. Let's go ahead and run this way. Do I have any honey or any hunter? Ooh, I do. Oh my this could be awkward all right all all of you guys all largos far away from me please i want every single one of you away from me while i gather these because if they ate one of these i just realized wallet no get away okay i thought somebody was coming on my left there but if they ate a hunter port it would be the end i would lose my entire apiary of carefully cultivated free range honey tabby largos because they could turn into tars so i need to get out of here i'm like carrying some it feels like you're carrying explosives when you've got uh plorts that don't match with your free range slimes oh my gosh speaking of free range look at our free range hen hens Jeez louise i love my place all right so let's go ahead and sell these 
because pretty much all of these except for the crystal plorts um uh, do i want to sell the honey plorts also this batch of honey plorts but i do need to keep some of them so i'll sell this many uh, and then I'll keep the rest and I think I can sell most of the tabby plorts But I do need to keep some honey plorts because oh my gosh, we just got the upper crust achievement I am wealthy. I am so wealthy. Oh my goodness. We've been trying to get that one for quite a while We've almost gotten to the plort tycoon achievement. Wow. Oh my gosh. Where's the upper crust discover the glass desert? Um, let's see incinerate an elder chicken and then hat trick. Oh man, one day, one day. And then control the chaos, six pack, full uh, pool party. Not full party, oh my goodness. Diversification, you monster. Send an adorable chick to a fire inn. No, never. I hope that's an achievement I never get. And then let's see, where the heck? Huh, dun 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 dun. Upper crust, upper crust. Oh, there it is. Earn over 100,000 new bucks. Oh, that's what they're called. Jeez, I feel silly now. There I am trying to figure out what I call the currency that I'm using and I'm all scratching my head and it's right there, right there in front of me. All right, well now that that chaos is done, let's run this way. And we're going to toss in my resources really quickly. Okay, there's those ones. And that's just the radioactive boom slime experiments we have going on in our yard. Don't worry about that, totally normal. And now we can purchase the ghoulie fashion pod. Dun, dun, dun. All right, so that is done. And I'll go ahead and purchase the gray slime lamp just in case, because I found purchasing and building stuff sometimes un starts to unlock some other things. Oh, jeez, that movement scared me. The little 3D printer movement. I was like, oh no, what's gotten loose in my shed? Oh, I'm so nervous lately. I guess I'm just expecting like a tar and like implosion of some kind to show up. So the googly fashion pod needs the royal jelly as well. And I guess that means we need to go over to the moss blanket and see if we can get some royal jelly. And then we also need to look around and we need to try to see if we can find more of the treasure pods. Apparently they're just all over the place and I just keep missing them. Hey, are you guys done yet? Come on! They're so close. They only have like a few more seconds, which means that those ones probably only have a few more seconds too. But all oh, the birds, geez, I love those guys. They're so pretty. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love this place. <sighs> but yes, apparently there's tons of fat or the uh, tons of treasure pods and I should be able to stumble on several of them. I, I just have been missing some of them. Um, I'm gonna have to do a little bit more exploring. I might even have to like look up professional guides because it's sort of ridiculous. I don't want to have to. I want to just be cool enough to like be able to be like is it up in this tree is it on top of something and be able to stumble on them but it's really hard to find them it makes for a good it makes for a good experiment where did you even come from did you come from the trees do you hatch out of bird eggs that's so interesting it makes for a really good challenge uh to like search in all the corners uncover everything jump on top of tree stumps and I really love how I've, oh, that's so pretty. I really love all the ones I've found. I just wish I knew where they were. Hmm. All right, well, I'm gonna look around. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, no! I found another advanced one. Oh, that's so frustrating. That's what I mean. I think I'm just missing like one of the, the other ones. But maybe if I'm a little bit more thorough in how I search, I'll be able to start finding them. Oh boy, hey, cool, cool your jets over there. I know that doesn't really do anything to them because they need fed, not smacked in the face with water. I guess that would make me cranky if I was like hungry and someone just shows up and like smacks me in the face with water. Okay, I'm not gonna want that pink plort because I'm gonna be harvesting a ton of stuff. Oh, this guy's ready. All right, let's start harvesting. All right. Oh, there's some hen hens. I hear that. Oh, all right, that guy is done. Let's gather these up. I got a slime fossil. And then, hi guys, give me just a second. Uh, we have decorations and a refinery link. Now that would be really useful to set up over here so I wouldn't have to go back and forth. But I think the refinery link is probably more useful to set up somewhere that's not next to one of my teleporters. All right, so let's start gathering up all of our resources. I need to make, ah, oh, darn, no royal jelly. I do need to make some more apiaries too. Oops, and then, ah, no royal jelly again? 
Fooey, I really needed royal jelly. Oh, 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 oh. We have a, um, I thought I had more of slime fossils than this. One second. I could have sworn multiple popped out. Huh. Okay, never mind. Yeah, we have one of the hexacombs. So I need to pick up that hexacomb in just a little bit. All right. And what do you have, my friend? Ah, the royal jelly is going to just be the end of me trying to get my hands on that. It's going to just send me right up a wall. All right. Well, let's pop over here and drop this off really quickly. And I guess I should do some treasure hunting, but okay. So I found lots and lots of different types of, um, of the advanced treasure pods. I think I need to look in more simple places. Let's see. Let's jump up here. You know what? I think I'm going to have to just like look up a little guide and go, where the heck are the easy treasure pods? I can't find them. And I'll have to work from there. Let me grab this. But let's see if I can get any of the other curios, any of the other like curiosities built right now. Um, I think we still need some more of our rare materials. But let's see. Yep, I need royal jelly for everything. Oh my gosh, royal jelly, why? And then can I make any more? I need those phosphor slimes for advanced apiaries. Uh, I can make an advanced pump actually, which would be pretty useful, an advanced drill as well. I need lots more pink plorts. All right, so I have now purchased the clip on and the googly fashion pods, but I don't have the ability to make them yet because we need some more royal jelly. So let's make sure that we just focus on uh, making a whole bunch of advanced apiaries never ever go without having enough of our um never ever ever go without having too few apiaries and then we should be at least one step closer to meeting some of our big goals and then i also need to make sure that we never ever go without feeding this hungry little crew right over here so let me pop over here let me gather up these if I give them a bunch of carrots and a bunch of odd onions, that should be good. And then what I'm going to do next time, and I debated on this because I, I don't, I, I really, I don't like to do things like look up guides to stuff too often, but I am truly perplexed. And if I read through some of the locations for where you can find the easier treasure pods that I need to finish cracking before I can buy the more advanced cracker, if I read through a bunch of them, and I'm gonna have to gather up. Up oh, there's an elder. I could have sworn there was an elder. Hmm. I need to start feeding some of my hen hens to my hungry slimes. It's always a sad moment. I'm sorry, Stony Hen. This is just the way things are. Oh, don't watch, don't watch. I'm so sorry. There we go. Uh, so sorry, Stony Hen hens. This is just this is just how it is. All right. If you guys are in the garden, new rule: if you're breaking into Siri's garden, you might end up becoming hunter food. I'm really apologetic about it, but the, the fact of the matter, even though this is a hen hen sanctuary, it doesn't look like we have enough elders at the moment. So it, it's just kind of random bad luck. All right, so I need to gather up some more carrots. Um, let's see, need to grow some more odd onions. There we go. And then all these carrots are going to go to my pink slimes because as long as my pink slimes are eating, they will be producing pink plorts and that is something that I desperately need. Uh, let's see more odd onions there we go all right but yeah so normally I don't like looking up um, a lot of guides on how to do things because I love just stumbling and bumbling and tripping over myself discovering the world on my own but this is this is getting to the point where it's like hmm we're crossing a line where this is almost no longer enjoyable tearing my hair out just trying to find this one thing so I'll look up a few guides and if it turns out the locations are super easy I will chide myself for being a very very silly Siri and I will try to find them some more on my own uh, after I, if I look at like two or three of them and I'm like oh that spot I should have just looked there then it will give me an idea of kind of hints of where I should be looking no Whew, that was close almost turned those guys into tars all right let's toss these in here and then once we finally 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 find the little hiding whatever it is in the treasure pod we should hopefully be able to get to the point where I can start cracking open those big treasure pods and who knows what we're gonna find in there so whew, still lots to do but at least we have all of the special um in fact can I run them back over are you guys ready to harvest yet Arr. let's let's do a very quick little experiment so let's go back to our house I'm beginning to think it would have been nice if I put the the warp portal well the house is really close 
So let's pop in here. Let's sleep until morning. And then let's go ahead and return to the ranch. Fashion pod remover! New blueprints are available! Ah, oh, I love this! I knew it! Time does make some of the new blueprints available! The fashion pod remover is now available! Oh, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Alright, and then let me pop over here. Aha! And that did take away eight hours, aka eight minutes, from the timer. So, if I'm really desperate, we can just start sleeping a lot. Kicking our legs back and sleeping quite a bit so I can try to get some more royal jelly. And I, I guess I should make a whole bunch of like lesser apiaries as well. And just make sure we're overflowing with apiaries in the moss blanket so that we'll be able to get some of that royal jelly. So whew, treasure hunting, royal jelly harvesting, perfectly balanced carrots that, that seem to... Okay. Wow. Oh, oh, it's like dominoes. Oh my gosh, that was awesome. They were just balanced until a breeze, like, and then you let a little breeze come by and they all go down. Oh, that's so much fun. I don't know why that tickles me so much. Oh, it just tickles my onions. That's what it does. All right, so I'm going to gather this up, feed my slimes, and then I, I'm giving in. I'm giving in and I'm going to look up, hopefully, some good guides at where some of the treasure is. And we are going to find these last easy treasure pods so that we can move on to having some of the other really amazing fun stuff that is included in slime science. And we just have no idea that exists because I can't crack open those treasure pods yet. Whew. All right, so I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.